Hello and welcome to Wandering Wanda. I'm Ariel. Today we are leaving the Triple G RV Park in Fort Nelson. I believe that's where we are. And we will be driving to Liard Hot Springs. Walter and I will not be going into the hot springs, but I will walk over there just to see what it looks like. Uh, we're not really hot springs people. And in October, we're going to Reykjavik, to the Blue Lagoon. At the end of this video is gon going to be the, the travel laps from Garmin from here to Liard Springs. It's supposedly a four hour drive. It may take us four and a half, maybe five, including all the stops. Our Triple G Hideaway RV Park in Fort Nelson. It's a nice park. The owners are friendly and I backed up for the first time with the owner's husband's help. He was very patient. Everyone here calls him Papa. So Papa, thank you for helping me back up for the first time. Here we are at a pullout on the Alaskan Highway. We just finished our 10% grade down there. 10% grade. We made it. Not a problem. Of course, we were following a big rig. And they were only going about 25 miles an hour, which is actually nice because the engine did not get exert itself but isn't this a magnificent view right here we are at Toad River Lodge we're gonna have lunch over there at that restaurant we've got a restaurant and a gift shop so let's see what they have Okay, we are leaving Toad? Toad. Toad, Toad out British Columbia. It's mile marker 4, 442 or 422, something like that. Uh, beautiful. Food was, was mediocre. <laughs> Wouldn't say it was the best, but it was nourishing and it was edible. So good stop still. We had lunch, it was nourishing. And we also got a full tank of gas here. Very good. So on to Laird, Laird? Laird Hot Springs. Laird, Laird Hearts. <laughs> Laird Hot Springs. Okay, here we are at the at a roadside, just just keeping our eye our eye out for wildlife. And there's a bison right over there. Bison. Look at that. We saw wildlife, finally. Oh, well, we saw two bears. We saw two bears in the last two, three days. So, we finally saw wildlife. Look, it's just eating. It's just crazy. Bison. to Liard Hot Springs. We're at their RV park. Other than the mosquitoes, it's actually okay. We are jammed in though. Look at this. <laughs> row after row. We are jammed in. So, it, so for overnight, this is fine. We have 30 amp and water and we are so not leveled. <laughs> We are not leveled. <laughs> okay, we're gonna walk around. Okay, we just had dinner there at Leard Hot Springs Lodge. Not really much of a lodge. Um, Eleven rooms. Yeah. Walter had a cheeseburger. I had their pork ribs. It was passable. And rice and salad and vegetables. So it was a good... It was a nourishing dinner, let's put it that way. I wouldn't go out of my way to give it five stars on Yelp. But, again, we are out in the wilderness. But, ooh, 
what we can get you can get food here which is not a problem be careful of the moose turns it is oh, there's just, apparently yeah. an entry fee of five dollars so they didn't quite realize that so, Liard River Hot Springs Provisional Park we're just gonna go take a look at it and see what it looks like I didn't want to drive all this way and not see it a fed bear is a dead bear oh dear lord it is through a swamp Oh my god. Okay, thank you. This is the mosquito breeding program over here. Okay, it just goes on and on. And on. Okay, we're still just walking. Walking. Oh my goodness, look at that. It goes on. It just goes on and on. The Yukon. It's all right. I didn't tell you it was at the Yukon border. We're at the hot springs, and I can you can feel the heat. Oh look, it's steaming over there. Oh, and they put little brick benches or concrete benches on the, and that must be the source right over there. Okay, well, we came all this way. Let me put my feet in. Walter, Walter's going in. Or Lisa's feet is. Walter is in. And it's hot. <laughs> Is it really that hot? Yes. For even for you who loves this stuff? Yes, even for me. Well, I can feel the heat coming out of it. Well, the water over there from the source is boiling. They do have changing rooms. And it looks like it's just a modesty room. <laughs> and here we are at the boardwalk, headed back. It is quite a hike to get over here. That was Liard Hot Springs. Would we stay at this campsite again? Probably, I would have to say yes, as long as it's only overnight. As far as the hot springs themselves, no. We're not going to go in. I'm really not a hot springs person, or hot water bathing person. Walter is at times, but too many mosquitoes here. Thank you for watching. Bye.